This is the story of the children of the Bethesda Chevy Chase Cluster, middle school overcrowding, and what our community is doing to deliver upon the promise of quality education. This short presentation covers four points. The need for a second middle school. The history of the Rock Creek Hill site. Litigation issues and status. And next steps for moving forward. Westland Middle School is built to educate up to 1,063 students. With 1,198 students today, Westland is already overcrowded. But by 2017, Westland's population will explode with 1,616 students, or 52% above capacity. Overcrowding is more acute than these numbers suggest, as more than 200 children are required to attend 6th grade at Chevy Chase Elementary and North Chevy Chase Elementary Schools. These are the only children in the county who cannot attend 6th grade in the traditional middle school setting. If all 6th graders in BCC cluster attended Westland, Westland would face an immediate overcrowding crisis at 1,410 students. While the status quo is a temporary stopgap, it also means some 6th graders do not benefit from the full middle school program. In short, the sooner a new middle school can be built, the sooner we can relieve overcrowding and deliver upon the promise of equal opportunity for all middle school children. So in January 2012, Superintendent Starr formed a Site Selection Advisory Committee to recommend potential sites for a future middle school. The committee was comprised of 47 members representing all stakeholders throughout the community. They evaluated 38 candidate sites and ultimately recommended two sites to the superintendent. The first site was Rock Creek Hills Local Park, the site of the former Kensington Junior High School, which received 130 points from the committee. The other site was North Chevy Chase Park, receiving 28 points. On March 30th of 2012, Superintendent Starr recommends the Rock Creek Hill site to the Board of Education. On April 17th, the Board of Education concurs with Dr. Starr's recommendation. And on May 24th, 2012, the Montgomery County Council approves funding for middle school number two at Rock Creek Hills. The Rock Creek Hill site is a 13-acre parcel off of East Saul Road in South Kensington. It is the site of the former Kensington Junior High School, and it is the only region in the cluster without a BCC cluster school. The Rock Creek Hill site has numerous advantages. The land is under public ownership. For many decades, it was home to the Kensington Junior High School in the heart of the Rock Creek Hills community. Under the deed to the property, MCPS has the legal authority to reclaim the site for school use. A feasibility study establishes the parcel's suitability for a middle school once again. And a middle school on the east side of the cluster will significantly reduce travel time for many students and facilitate parent involvement. Next steps. Planning begins in the fiscal year beginning July 1, 2013. Construction of the school begins in 2015, and the middle school is scheduled to open in August 2017. But before all this may occur, County Executive Leggett must consent to the land transfer before transfer proceedings may begin. Mr. Leggett supports the middle school at Rock Creek Hills, but on the advice of Council, Mr. Leggett has deferred his consent to the land transfer. The reason? Litigation. August 16, 2012. The Rock Creek Hills Citizens Association and nine individuals who reside adjacent to the park file a lawsuit in Montgomery County Circuit Court. Their objective? Block a new middle school from returning to their community. The lawsuit alleges that because $172,000 in public funds were used to help offset the cost of parking lots, ball fields, and tennis courts, that the land may not be conveyed back to MCPS for school purposes unless the government provides a comparable replacement park. Other complaints, reduced property values, inconvenience, detrimental to residents, 
and higher taxes. After months of activity and oral arguments, the circuit court issued its ruling on April 23rd. The court ruled in favor of the government on all counts and dismissed the case in its entirety. Among its numerous findings, the court found that the plaintiffs do not have taxpayer standing to challenge the county's execution of the transfer agreement. The court found that the transfer agreement is lawful and that no violation of statute had occurred. The court also upheld the reclamation clause, finding further that even if on appeal, if the reclamation clause is found to be unenforceable, the remedy would be to restore the land back to its original owner, which is to say, the land would go back to Montgomery County Public Schools. Finally, the court found that the plaintiffs provided no evidence that their taxes would increase or their property values would decrease. The court also provides some instructive history on the Rock Creek Hills site. After Kensington Junior High School was closed, the county engaged a public process to solicit views on future use of the property. Various proposals were made, including proposals by private parties to purchase the property. But the court also found that many community members wrote the county and the planning board to urge the county not to sell the property, but to use it as a park so that it could be reclaimed as a school as future needs dictated. Finally, moving forward. Planning activities for the new school must begin during the fiscal year beginning July 1st. Despite having lost on all counts, the Rock Creek Hills Citizens Association and the nine individual plaintiffs announced on April 28th that they will appeal the decision. While continuing litigation could delay the school with consequences for 1,600 middle school children, County Executive Leggett can initiate the land transfer to keep the school moving forward. This is a defining issue for the children of our community and for future generations. And we respectfully urge our county leaders and our entire community to work together to keep the new middle school on track.